Hey guys, it's Taylor. Welcome back to oh my god. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I am filming my nighttime skincare routine. Over the past couple of years, I've used a lot of different skincare regimens, a lot of different brands, and I finally figured out what works for me. Yeah, so today I'm gonna share with you what I've been using for the past couple months, what has been working for me, and hopefully it will work for you. There's no guarantee, everyone's skin is different, but here is my process. So I start every night by taking a shower. It's nice and cold. It's cold. So I usually wash my face in the shower. I've been using the Clinique for Men face wash for a couple months uh, and it's been really working. So I'll just do like a little dab, rub it in my hands and then Rub this in for like 30 or 45 seconds till I feel like it's clean. So I like to wash my face in the shower just because I feel like the hot water opens up my pores. After I cleanse my face, I use this Amore Pacific enzyme peel. It's like a exfoliator so you just take a little bit it's like a powder and you just put some in there and then you rub it together in your hands it turns into like this really foamy and then massage massage so I do this for another like 30 or 45 seconds so I'm feeling good. It's like la, 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 la. <laughs> it's hard to turn. and then rinse. All right, so let's get a towel. All right, so pat. I always pat my face dry. I don't want the towel to like tear up my skin. And also when drying your hair, I always like grab and then hold. Cause someone told me that like rubbing it back and forth can like tear up your hair follicles and stuff. So this is what I do. Get behind your ears. All right. All clean. We have cleansed, we have exfoliated, and now we will Tone. So I use this cleansing toner by this brand Herbivore. I'm pretty sure it's all natural ingredients. I use this jasmine green tea. Push my hair back and then from like yay distance away I will do like four sprays. So typically I would like brush my teeth during this time while this is drying or you can rub it in. So I'm just gonna fan it. So now we have cleansed and toned. I feel like toner is a step that a lot of people skip, um, but I feel like it really does balance out my skin. So now we have cleansed, exfoliated, and toned, and now I'm going to use my Kiehl's facial oil. This one is the cannabis sativa seed oil. So this I really like, helps if you have acne prone or blemish prone skin. It does not, it's like, it is oily, but it doesn't cause you to break out. It really does moisturize your skin. So what I do typically has like this little dauber. So I take this and then I just do like one drop on this cheek, one drop on this cheek, and then I just drag it across my forehead. Sad. So then I just take it and I rub it all over. It really does make my face feel like really moisturized. So I rub that everywhere. You can kind of see it. 
And then after that, on a typical night, after that step, I would moisturize. Normally, on, the, on a regular night, I would use this daily moisturizing lotion. Really get everywhere. Don't forget about your neck again. But I have been using, I do not know how to say this, so Laneige. Laneige maybe? Laneige? Laneige, okay. So I use this probably three nights a week and I swear by this stuff, this is a water sleeping mask. It is just like that, nice like texture, I don't know how you would describe it. And so I'll just take like my fingers in it and get like this much, that might be a lot actually. And then I just like dab it here, dab it here on my nose, and like that dab it around my face, and then I just rub it in. Don't like rub it in completely, you want a little bit to sit on your face because it just soaks in. Um, this might be a little uncomfortable when you first start using it because you like are supposed to be going to bed right now and having this kind of sit on your face. It does dry pretty quickly, but it does feel a little weird. You can kind of see it sitting. So yeah, just do that. Neck, 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 neck. So I do that probably three nights a week and I wake up with my skin being like super hydrated. And then I use the same brand, which I can't pronounce, the Lip Sleeping Mask. This I also swear by. I swear by all this. I've been using this exact skincare um, routine for like probably three months and have had no issues and only been improving. But this is great. You just take it's like a more hard type, like chapstick almost. And you just take, they sent me a little thing to dig it out, but I don't use that. So I just put my finger in there. Just put that on and leave it on. One other thing that I do, so if you do have any like bumps or acne or anything that you know you want to get rid of, I've been using this Kate Somerville Eradicate. I just put my finger on top, dump it over, and then I dab anywhere I have any acne prone, so like right there, do a little dab, and I think I got it. Um, and that thing right there. And then I'll wake up and typically those will be either on their way out or completely gone. And then finally, for my hair, my hair, I've been growing it out lately, um, but every night I'll use, not every night, maybe like most nights, I'll use this It's a 10 Miracle Leave-In product just to give my hair some extra moisture. I'll either usually spray it in when it's a little damp, and then I'll spray a little bit in my hands, and then just rub it together, and then rip it through. It gets all in there. And then I am ready for bed. So that is my nightly skincare routine. Um, I hope that that helps you. If you want any of the brands, I will link them all below. I will link all the products below and you can check them out. If you have any tips or anything that you use that you think I should try out, please let me know. But yeah, that is it. Now I'm off to bed. So hope you guys liked it. Please like, share, subscribe.